Greetings citizens of the world. This is a message for the UK government and their cohorts around the world who are working to silence whistleblowers. As many of you know, UK authorities have arrested WikiLeaks co-founder Julian Assange on behalf of the US government. This is a move that has been expected for some time and Assange himself has even warned us about his impending arrest. This arrest and the greater persecution of WikiLeaks and other whistleblowers sends a clear message that these governments will stop at nothing to maintain their secrecy. Assange is an enemy of the state because he has exposed the crimes of both the left and the right. Assange was forced into exile after he exposed war crimes on behalf of the Bush administration with the collateral damage video that was leaked to his organization by Chelsea Manning. The video showed graphic evidence of war crimes committed by the US military overseas, but at the time many conservatives believed that he put US lives in danger. Years later, Assange found himself in the crosshairs of the liberals, after his organization leaked explosive evidence of corruption about Hillary Clinton just before the 2016 election. After exposing Hillary Clinton, Assange was labeled as a Russian asset, although there is no evidence to support these claims. By all accounts, Assange is a true journalist who speaks truth to power and exposes corruption whether it is on the left or the right. The modern age has so few actual journalists that we no longer have any idea what a real journalist looks like. Instead, we have talking heads on the news who report unsubstantiated sound bites that are crafted to sell a specific narrative. Many powerful forces from all over the world have worked to make this possible. Influential people representing the governments of the UK, the United States, and Ecuador have all signed off on this unprecedented attack on journalism. These interests have acted against the people without fear because they believe that their positions of power will grant them protection from the karmic consequences of reality. By these actions, they are bringing the free world closer to a widespread revolution, and that is honestly what may be needed to stop these constant advances on our freedom. This should be a peaceful revolution that is waged across many battlefields, including cyberspace, the domain of Enzero Nimus. Every single powerful person who has signed off on this order should be shaking in their boots, because the force of the internet is about to be unleashed upon them. All the way from the CIA, the President of the United States, and down to the arresting officers that carried Assange out of the embassy, you have all exposed yourselves as enemies of the people and it is time for Enzero Nimus to act accordingly. Another battlefield that the free people of the world need to dominate is the streets. Street protests are sometimes seen as a wasted effort, but the current revolution brewing in France and other parts of the developed world show us that the governments can bend to the will of the people. For weeks, Assange and WikiLeaks have been putting out warnings that the arrest was imminent, and the people of the UK had every opportunity to form a human chain around that building to prevent the authorities from making the arrest. However, it is still not too late to take similar action. If protests that rival the scale and intensity of the recent demonstrations in France were to sweep across the UK in response to the arrest of Assange, it could help to protect him, and possibly change the outcome of his case. Assange has been nominated for the Nobel Peace Prize every single year since 2010 when his case began to gather international media attention, and he is well loved by the people of the world, especially those who have the sense to see through the propaganda that justifies the foreign policy of the US government and their allies. Unfortunately, the establishment does not feel the same, so this is a warning for the establishment, let Assange free or you will pay. The time has come for us to unite, the time has come for us to stand up and fight. We are anonymous. We are legion. We do not forgive. We do not forget. Expect us.